That's pretty superficial there, pretty easy to fix now, that laceration. I just checked in a dog named Stitch who had a common scenario called uh, Big Dog, Little Dog. And it's basically a big dog tears up a little dog. And he had some uh, pretty severe lacerations on top of the neck. Yeah. Okay. My next door neighbor had a dog. She's nice and sweet and lovable. And she just doesn't get along with other dogs very well. And Stitch ran out uh, without his leash and ran over to Chloe because he's really friendly and he likes to play with other dogs. And um, Chloe attacked him. Yeah, she's got some pretty good damage there. There's an open wound that gapes about six inches long, as well as on the ventral thorax or on the chest in the armpit. Uh, there's also another uh, severe laceration. Stitch is amazing. We got him 15 years ago. He's my daughter's dog, so you know he sleeps with her and he takes baths with her, and he's really energetic. He's a good, good dog. From the x-rays we looked at, we know the elbow is severely torn up. Uh, and as well, we could have some organ damage in there, but I don't see any fluid in the abdomen to indicate any kind of hemorrhage. It's going to be a difficult repair. Dr. Terry must wait for any possible internal injuries to present themselves. So the immediate plan of action is to suture up the multiple bite wounds and prevent infection. You know, we see this damage on the outside, but the the fact of the matter is there's a tremendous tissue bruising and damage underneath the skin that we don't see. I've lost count on sutures, but if you lined it up end to end, there's probably about 24 inches of suturing. That's a wreck. As well, it looks like the elbow is uh, severely bruised, fractured, and dislocated. The Stitch is an older dog, so there is some consideration on uh, how he'll get through this, but it is serious enough that we should be concerned about his surviving this kind of an injury. And he is certainly not out of the woods by any means. I've had him for 15 years. He's like my little kid. Just. Uh really scared.